Insta360 Studio 2021 tutorial. Import and play 360 videos. Open Insta360 Studio 2021. Example is a 5.7K video shot on 1x2. Connect the camera or SD card to the computer. Insta360 footage is automatically recognized. Choose to import all files or a specific selection. Note, files are not saved locally on the computer. 5.7K360 videos are separated into two files. Just select one to import and its corresponding file will be added automatically. You can preview the footage in the thumbnail within the file window. Note, thumbnail preview requires the corresponding LRV file. The footage panel is displayed by default. Click Window on the top menu bar to customize the panels displayed. In the View window, you can preview different perspectives such as Fisheye, Tiny Planet, Crystal Ball, Natural View, and Flat. Flow State Stabilization. You can toggle on and off Flow State Stabilization and Direction Lock. Flow State Stabilization is turned on by default to make it easier to set keyframes with free capture. If you turn on Flow State during or after your edit, your video will re-render and angles will change. Stitching. Make sure to adjust the stitching settings if your footage was shot using a lens guard or case. If you're not happy with the stitching, select a reference frame to apply stitching calibration to the clip. Editing. Set a start and end point for your video. To trim the video, select a start point on the timeline. Then select an end point on the timeline Then click Free Capture to start your edit. You are free to adjust the aspect ratio. The default is 16 to 9. Click the keyframe button to add a new keyframe. Use keyframes to customize the pan, tilt, FOV, and distance for any frame in your clip. Drag to get the angle you want. Or manually set parameters in the keyframe window. Click Edit on the top menu bar to undo or redo. Use Command plus Z, Mac OS, or Control plus Z, Windows to undo the previous action. Use Command plus Shift plus Z, Mac OS, or Control plus Shift plus Z, Windows to redo the last change. Zoom in and out on the timeline for easier editing. Add as many keyframes as you want. To readjust a keyframe, click the icon to open the window. You can also drag keyframes to different points on the timeline and their settings remain intact. You can set transitions between any pair of keyframes. Try following the motion of the subject in a shot. Set transitions between keyframes and choose from multiple effects. Try changing the perspective here if desired, for example to a tiny planet. Editing a bullet time clip. Import a bullet time file. Set a start and end point for your video. Adjust the FOV and distance settings as desired. Select the aspect ratio. 
Bullet time videos do not support free capture and flow state stabilization must be turned on. Remember to adjust the stitching settings if your footage was shot using a lens guard or case. And if you're unsatisfied with the stitch, you can select a reference frame to apply a stitching correction. Project Management Before exporting the video, you can save different edits. Select Project Management. Click Add Project to create an unedited version of the original file. Save the previous edit and start working on a new version. Select Settings and Storage Location, then Export. Alternatively, click Add to Queue to export all the videos later in one go.